Right guys, Gaft is back with the explanation to yesterday's card trick. And I've just got this really fancy leather deck case holder. Brilliant. Oh, left the card in there. Really brilliant little case, nice and solid, made of leather, so that keeps your card safe. Right, what you're going to need is your um, swap wallet. A Z-fold wallet would work fine. This is the Uday swap wallet. Um, it's a fantastic little gimmick this is. It's basically a Z-fold wallet. So you're going to get your fourth card, which in my case is a four of diamonds. I'm going to place it into the wallet, preloaded, and then we'll start. Um, the rest of the trick is you've got your crimped card. In my case, it's the Jack of Spades crimped. That is going to go on the bottom of the deck, followed by the other three fours. That is your setup. Right, you'll go to your spectator. Um, I've got a wallet here. I'm going to spread the cards on the table. I want you to pick a card. Now, they can't pick one of the bottom four cards. It's unlikely they're going to pick one of those. So let's say they pick this one. It doesn't matter what this card is. They're never going to see it. You're just going to place it into the wallet. And then you're going to make sure you shut up the wallet the right way. So, you know, when you open it, you'll be forcing the four of diamonds. Place it off to the side. And then you'll get your spectator to cut the cards. Now they can do this first part. So just cut the cards there. They'll cut some cards, doesn't matter how many. And then I want you to cut this pile here and then get them to look at this card. Now this is a free choice. There's no chance anyone's gonna know what this card is, but for demonstration purposes, I'm gonna show you it's the Queen of Hearts. You'll take this card, place it on the, this pile and get them to pick up the rest of this packet, which is gonna place your force fours and the crimp card directly on top you'll then get them to cut this packet and bury this somewhere in the middle so to the spectator they've just picked a random card it's been then put back into the pack and lost and just as you pick up the cards you're just going to cut at the crimp and do one more cut what that would have done will have placed their card fourth from top you can now spread these cards and say look we're going to go back to the card in the wallet the card you chose at the beginning was the four of diamonds. We're going to use the value of this card and we're going to count. You're going to go one, two, three, and the fourth card, as if by magic, will be the spectators. Queen of hearts. And not only that, you found the other three fours. So that's how simple the trick was, guys. Just using the Uday swap wallet. This could be a Z fold wallet or whatever it wants to be but this is what I'm using I know a lot of you guys are finding this hard to find it's sold out everywhere um, it's quite an old I don't think the Uday swap wallets are new a new wallet so I'm quite surprised it's still unavailable but it is fantastic so that's how I did it guys make sure to smash the like button subscribe to the Gaff Academy post notifications on and we'll see you tomorrow for the reveal cheers not the reveal, I've done that, another trick. Cheers.